Hey, what's up everybody and welcome back to another video and today You may probably see in the camera Oh, yeah, we'll be reviewing the PlayStation 5 and Man, oh man Back here, of course, it's on its stand But yeah, we got the PS5 here And it is beautiful So I'll just put it like right here you know what I mean? Um, the PS5. It's a good console. I played uh, Spider-Man on here. Infamous Second Son. Um, G-O-W. Or you know what I'm meaning by that. Um, what other games? I play Fortnite on this thing, etc., etc. Uh, Horizon Forbidden West. Play that too. But anyway, the PS5 is good in 2024. It provides really good gaming um, gameplay. And the number one thing I'll say about this console is it has fantastic graphics. Uh, this is a older... You could probably say the fat model PS5, the older model, but um, <clears throat> I still use it like um, oftenly and stuff. I don't really see any problems with the console. It, it, it looks futuristic, uh, the PS5 does. It looks pretty futuristic. That's what I like about the design of this thing. It looks really futuristic, has that cool LED lights going through. It's pretty cool. You can case swap it. You can swap the M.2 in it. Or put an M.2, I meant to say. And, yeah. Pretty awesome console. Is the PS5 still worth it in this day and age? Yes. And if you want a... Very budget, or not budget, I may say high-end console. This is your way to go. Uh, your budget console nowadays will probably be the PS4 Pro or the PS4 Slim. But um, it does fantastic. I like the PS5. Uh, I, I actually play Tekken on this device, and it's fantastic. Contr controllers. And the dual sense, amazing. Like I'm not even kidding you. And like um, it, I think the PS5 controller is like the second best controller in fighting games right now. Um, right with the fighting sticks uh, that people use, like kind of like arcade style, in a way. I don't know. This the PS5 controller feels good with fighting games, and that's that's what I like about it. And, um, <clears throat> and yeah, you can, like I said, you can expand the storage. I haven't expanded the storage in this device because, like, I don't know, I didn't have that much games on it. And it keeps up the storage pretty well. And it can fit anywhere in, like, an open space. I will say, please put... Please screw the screw in into the stand for the PS5. It allows like uh, an inch or two from the base and up. It allow airflow, and it has good it has good cooling in it. Same with the Series X, it has fantastic cooling. In it. And if you want to go check out my Series X video, you give that a thumbs up. That'd be awesome. Uh, but yeah, I enjoy this console. This is like almost like the Series X review. This is a two year old review here. Had this console for two years. And I love both the Series X and the PS5. They're really great consoles. And if you want to choose between which one you need to choose, It'd be up to you and what your needs. Like game wise, be up to you because 
gamers are just gamers. Gaming consoles are just gaming consoles. I mean, it doesn't matter what you choose. You're still going to get the best out of the best. You're still going to get a good gaming console. So, that's what I will say. So, um, yeah. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe and comment down below on what's your favorite game for the PlayStation 5. And I'll see you wonderful people in the next video. Bye-bye!